Where am I supposed to go? Are you starting or? Yeah, we'll be soon. Oh, here we go. Pirate years. Oh, Look, it's uh, oh, it's Yosemite Sam. Maybe you're ready. I'm good. Yep. All right, we're here, back in Bugs Bunny, lost in space, lost in time, lost in space and time. Here, because zero okay. kilometers. Miami, fifteen kilometers. London, eight hundred and sixty-seven kilometers. Moon, two hundred and fifty. 200,575 kilometers. Serbia, far away. <laughs> New York, 654 kilometers. Miami, still 15 kilometers. Um, Quebec, 101 kilometers. It feels like they're changing every time. Probably. What's up, Doc? What the fuck is this? This is what I asked for. Uh, dude. What are you looking for again? How many discs does Metal Gear Solid 1 have? Top shelf. Top shelf over there. Top draw. Hey, what's up, Doc? Mm, this year's mine. Come back here, you mangy mutant. I actually have Metal Gear Solid. Apologies, it's two discs. There we go. I don't remember where it changes over. I was totally going to take that if I could go find go, go see Kojima. Two discs. Get five of these I think I bought it ages ago because I wanted to play it and I never got around to it. I bought it when uh, we still had our game traders here. It cost me like $100 or something. Dude, you should play it. It's a great game. Hey, look. Crabs, just like the ones in uh, Banjo Kazooie. Just, uh, they have less frames. It's kind of funny that this game came out, I suppose, after Banjo Kazooie. When did Banjo Kazooie come out? Oh no, Banjo Kazooie, I think, came out in 2000. Okay, Google. Okay, Google. Okay, Google. When did Banjo Kazooie come out? 2000. I'm guessing 2000. Banjo-Kazooie is a platform video game developed by Rare and originally released for the Nintendo 64 video game console on the 29th of June 1998 in North America and the 17th of July 1998 in Europe. Came out before. Console. <laughs> I like console. how there was a space between right. game and console. Right, ready? Ready? We're ready? We're Which one are we looking for? The middle one. Is the, the left one. one. We want. The left one. Middle one. Left one. Oh, I was going to kick the pirate. Pirate is the one you don't want. Yeah, you kick him. <laughs> and now we watch again so we can get the golden carrot. Or is that just a regular carrot? That's alright. Right. Left. I don't think it ever changes. I think it's always the fucking same. No, it was different that time. No, it wasn't. Because the clock was in the middle. Oh, was there two in it? Yeah. Ah, oh, I, I thought that, like, the second time was... Se something separate. I love those type of like I say puzzles very loosely because it's not necessarily a puzzle. No, it's not. But I like those sort of things because I'm always decent at them. Hello. That's Hi. Right. Can I pick this up? What button was it? Ah, uh, circle. Circle. Circle to pick up things. No. Can I kick it? I can kick it. One. Ah, oh, fucking collectible things. I get you. Jesus Christ. Can I not do that, please? Can I? Can I jump the gap? I cannot jump the gap. Let's go for a swim, bugs. The gap was too big. Uh. Sorry, I'm just looking at my saved articles because I, I usually save things to talk about. Yeah, right. I'm, um, I, I'm paying 100% oh, attention. Right, so I was talking to you. Oh, I found uh, we're, we're at a part in D&D um, &D where we're all going to die. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm pretty sure we're going to die. Motherfucker. We, um... We've, we've all pretty much decided we should probably start looking at what we should make our next characters. All right. I think I know what my next character will be. A princess, if right. you allow it. All right. I will send you the, the stats and everything. That'd be fantastic. Because uh, it's all on the the D&D &D wiki. Uh, well, not D&D &D wiki, the D&D &D Facebook page. Is it a homebrew? Uh, yes. All right. It's someone's made it, but they made it like proper... 
uh, format, yeah, sort of thing. Um, what's its abilities? Yeah, well, uh, that's was my going to be my question. What does it? Do? There's t there's princess types. You've got the classical princess, which is um, like what Princess Peach, that embodies the concept of a damsel in distress. Usually, she is reliant upon others to defend her and destroy her enemies. These princesses are most likely to be evil, selfish, or greedy. That'd be annoying as fuck. And you got different, um, like, abilities there. Then you've got the fairy tale princess. Ones with a magical past, considered how you... Oh, were you blessed by... Like, this just says how, you, how did you gain your magical power sort of thing. And then there's the warrior princess, <laughs> mm -hmm. which is like... Dina. Yeah, pretty much. I'm, like, it's got, like, fucking uh, war cry, extra attack. Yeah, doesn't she have a war cry? Like the... Oh, yeah, 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 thing? oh that would be fucking so good. Um. Yeah, and then you got like fucking majestic tra traits. Well, and the all this thing shit. is, because I know what Gary wants to play next. Everyone will end up wanting to play fucking homebrew champ people. But he, he and I were actually thinking of doing twins, twin barbarian halflings that okay. finish each other's sandwiches. So they're dumb as dog shit. We were we were gonna play as a brother and sister twin that finish each other's sentences, but always finish it wrong. So it'd be like... That'd be pretty fucking you know, cool, actually. Hey, have you seen my coat of arms? <laughs> <laughs> I would actually like that. That'd be fun to play. So I think we might do that, and then I'll run a princess one in another campaign. If you do an evil campaign, like you were talking about, I'll be an evil princess. Uh, I'm not <laughs> sure if I want to do an evil campaign just yet, but you guys have little faith in yourselves. <laughs> I, like, I think we're in a bit of a pickle at the moment. I mean, you are. Did you want to at least give some people, anyone that's watching, some background on what you are going through right now? So, we're, we're in, a, in our D&D &D campaign. Gee, they are throwing their hands out. Um, we decided to follow some... What are they called? I, they're called Will-O-Wisps. Will-O-Wisps. Uh, into a cave. Everyone that plays Dungeons & Dragons have currently got their hands in their head. Their heads in their hands. We didn't know they were Will-O-Wisps, because we didn't look into it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I tried to, but... I, you, rolled, I kept rolling so fucking yeah, well. Yeah, I, I rolled okay. Um, you rolled 21. But you rolled much better. I rolled a natural 20, which for deception would have been 20... I want to say 23. Um, okay. Obviously not what you wanted to do. No, what I'm trying to do is remember the pickup. There it is. There it is. Um, Dead Rosin came out. Um, so we followed them into a cave... And then discovered there's a dragon in that cave. A black dragon, adult black dragon. Mm -hmm. So um, we're going to fight him in his lair, which is going to be a lot of fun. I can't wait. Looking forward to that. I, I mean, I hope, I really hope we survive. Because I would hate for the campaign to end there. Yeah. Though I can see how it might go. Then I might get fed to the sharks. I think so. I think at least one of us is going to die. I came very close. I think Gary and I both came very close last week, uh, yeah. like last last time we played, and we were pretty much ready right then. We're like, all right, we're going to have to do our twins very soon. <laughs> um, but it's going to be a lot of fun. I, like, I'm excited to fight a dragon, like because we fought a dragon before, but it was a young, a dragon. young green dragon, and they're not nothing special. And we weren't even supposed to kill that one. No, it was just that. Jacob intimidated him. No, Jacob um, actually did rather well against it. So he rolled a intimidation, wasn't it? Yeah, that succeeded. Yeah, and that boosted us a fucking lot. That's the reason why you're at the level you are at now. Half the reason that you are above level what you're not supposed to be, what you are supposed to be at. Um, oh, well, jump up, oh, motherfucker! Oh, obviously not jumping that far. But uh, yeah, I, I mean, I'm looking forward to it. God oh, damn it! And I know you are. Well, I'm setting it all up currently as we're... Well, not as we speak, but I'm setting it up as... As this video is recording. As uh, this video is recording, releasing. I'm not, but... Releasing. Pro probably releasing. What would be... This would be... Wednesday? <sighs> I'm not sure, dude. Thursday. Um, Thursday. Thursday. We would have already had the fight. Yes, actually, yes. So, as we speak, we're probably all dead, some of us dead, or 
a dragon's dead. Well, the idea, because I, I have a slight idea on what I want to do for the next one. If if everyone wipes, I already know how I'm going to run the next story. It's going to be homebrew. Okay, you're just going to go in straight into homebrew. Yep. Um, and I, I will do a session zero. Do you know what a session zero is? Yeah, yeah. Um, can I pick this up? I'd like to DM a session. Like a, a game. Do a one-off. Um, sort of thing. One day. Like, I'd yeah. like to get a group of us and, and for me to DM. That's fine. It, I, D, people always get worried because about how you DM. Like, DM's, DM's actually not that hard. As long as you are creative. Okay. Uh, <laughs> did that just literally freeze? Yeah, I believe so. Um, I told you to pick it up. Okay. So, action button to pick it up. So, you circle. Never mind. I just fell off the edge of the, the thing. I'm on the edge um, of the world. But, um, it, DMing's not as hard as people make it out to be, as long as you take the time to learn. Um... My first session was a little touch and go because I didn't know what I was doing. Now I've been DM for probably close to... Six months. Oh, if not a little bit longer. Yeah. Um, and it's getting better. I'm oh, definitely improving. Uh, my skills fantastic. are improving. I, I'm realizing now that I can basically stone face things away. People like ask me questions and I just won't give them answers. <laughs> yeah, you won't budge. <laughs> you will not budge. Like, what about this? It's like, well, so you cool. can roll for it. There we yeah. go. Okay, so it's got a fucking timer. Yep. Let me guess if I get hit, I lose it. Yep. Um, hey. I, I would like to say that I was testing the waters there, but that was just me not. Um, hang on. Jesus Christ. All right, we might end it and uh, pick this up tomorrow. All right, I'll do, I'll do the Alice thing here. There we go. Yeah. All Watch right. out for the barrel. Watch out for the barrel. Bye. Watch out for the barrel. Bye. Hey. <laughs> it did get you. All right. Thinking. What? Uh, 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 uh.